Welcome everyone. So today a lot of people thought that the answer for this one was what? 6. Please understand whenever you have a root of any number. Okay. So basically we can put everything under one root. We had negative 6, negative 6. So a lot of people think that we can do negative 6 into negative 6. Which gets you root of 36 and the answer is 6. Which is incorrect. The reason for that is that in case of negative root, okay, we always split the root as what root of 6 into minus 1. So we have root 6 into root minus 1 into root 6 into root minus 1. So now what happens is <coughs> what is the value of root of minus 1? The value for root of minus 1 is just i. Okay. So, here we have root 6 into root 6. So, instead of that, because now it's positive, we can put everything under one root. Into, instead of minus 1, I can write it as what i into i. i is basically an imaginary number. Okay. So, now we know that root 6 into root 6 is nothing but what just 6. And we get i square. Now if I want to find the value of i square, I will square both sides. So root of minus 1 the whole square. Therefore, I can say i square equals to minus 1. So this gets you 6 into minus 1. So answer is coming out to be minus 6. Okay, I hope this is very very clear to everyone. That's it for today. I will see you in the next video.